All right, class, what is the answer? I know the answer. No, Mr. Peterson, do not call on Freddy. I regret to inform you that my fish strangely went missing last night, and I suspect that Freddy broke into my house and swallowed it. What tarnation are you talking about? Guilty! Suffer my wrath! Okay, it appears the two of them are busy. So, Jonah, what's the answer? Not again. I wasn't raising my hand. Okay, Jonah. <clears throat> Just private talk. You and I. How many times do I have to tell you that you're a failure before you do something productive with your life? I don't get it. I mean, my family told me that I was a failure my entire childhood. And look at me now. I'm the most successful teacher. You had 20 students at the beginning of the year. Now you have three. You talked without raising your hand. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. How is someone such an idiot? How are you capable of being so dumb? Did you hit your head when you were really little? Is that what happened? That's the only possible explanation I can find for you being so stupid. And remember, when that person knocks you down, saying that you don't matter, you stand right back up. You wipe the dust off you, you wipe the insults off you. And remember that I love you. Just like everyone should. Hey, Mr. Peterson. Principal Huggins, I didn't even know you came in. Bobby. Yes, sir. I, I need you to give me a compliment, okay? You'll get a sticker. With honor. Mr. Peterson, you are hands down the best English teacher in this school. Well, thanks, Bobby. That's so kind of you. Kids. I thought he taught math. No, it's science. Well, the best kind of teacher is the teacher that doesn't have to do their job. That's what I say. Who's with me? Stop it! Okay, class, um... It's time for my daily motivational story that we do every day. So I want everyone to get in a circle. Uh, Principal Huggins, you can too. No, I'm all right. All right, class, this is a true story. So, I was about your age, and I had a friend named Chris. I could tell anything to Chris. Chris would keep any secret I told him. I could trust him with anything. What are you doing? Shh! Until I found out that I couldn't! Because I found out that Chris was trash-talking me behind my back. I thought I could trust Chris with a secret, and then he told everyone. And I, th I thought it was gonna get better. I did. But then... About a week later, my wife divorced me. I thought you said you were our age. Just stop interrupting! But that's besides the point. Do you know what happened to Chris? You want to know where Chris is? You want to know what happened to him? Mr. Peterson, can you come here for a second? Of course. Hold on. Yes. I have no doubt when I tell you that you are fired.